Good morning, everyone. This is Trey from Midwest Aid Trips here in Pecos, Texas. Today is day eight of our trip. Midwest Aid Trips goes west. We're heading home, so let's check it out. Let's get on the road. Today's trip takes us from Pecos, Texas to Purcell, Oklahoma. Just stopping for gas. Very lovely singing. Steak, big letters. Breakfast, steak. Lunch, dinner. All right, so we didn't know this, but apparently Dairy Queens across the country carry different things. They have tacos. I got something called the Dude, which is a chicken fried steak on the burger. She got a Frito pie burger, so yeah. Good morning, everyone. As I said yesterday, there's just nothing to do on that part of the road through Texas. So we ended up driving all day, not doing much of anything. So here we go again with day nine, the final day. We are going home today, so let's get on the road. Today's trip takes us from Purcell, Oklahoma, back home to St. Louis. All right, here we are at the Museum of Osteology in Oklahoma City. Let's go in and check it out.
place claims to be the largest collection of skeletons in the USA. No animals were harmed or killed for this museum. Anyway, we're done here, so let's get back on the road. Chandler, Oklahoma, making our next stop, which happens to be on historic Route 66. This is the Route 66 Interpretive Center. All right, totally cool. I did want to point out that this place used to be a National Guard armory. It has a really cool structure to it. Definitely, definitely worth noting. Anyway, let's get on the road and head to the next stop. One thing I wanted to mention since we started doing these Route 66 attractions, we've been meeting so many friendly people from all over. Not just the proprietors of these places, but also the guests. We just met a group of people from New York. They're doing Route 66 on motorcycles. So friendly. And we've met so many people just like that. You definitely gotta check it out. So here we are in Tulsa, Oklahoma, checking out the Mother Road Market, and it is lunchtime, so let's walk in and check it out. Okay, I am so happy we checked that out, because that was awesome. I will definitely be back, and I recommend that you do too. Anyway, let's move on to the next location. All 
variety. We just stopped in Catoosa, Oklahoma, not too far outside of Tulsa. We're checking out the blue whale of Catoosa. Let's go. Yes. All righty, that's a fun little stop. Anyway, we're gonna get back on the road and check out the next thing. So let's hit the road. Alright, so here we are at the Will Rogers Museum, so let's go check it out. Alright, that is done now. We are getting back on the road. And I'm not sure if we're going to have time for any more stops, so let's hit the road and get back to St. Louis. Alright, so here we are in Benita, Oklahoma, right off of I-44. And here we have McDonald's. Of course, McDonald's is something we would never ever showcase on this channel unless there was something specific about this location, which there is. This is a unique location in the sense that it is situated over the interstate. And from what I understand, this place used to only be McDonald's and the archways over the interstate used to be yellow, but then they added a subway too. Yeah, it's pretty interesting in here. At least it's air conditioned. We are in the middle of a heat wave, so I welcome any chance to get some, some cold air into my life. Anyway, back on the road. We are home now and we are very happy to be home. I didn't really want the trip to end until around the time we hit the Missouri border. At that point I was ready. I think it was the familiarity of the state. Either that or just the fact that we were now close enough. Regardless, we're home and it's over. Don't forget to check out all the other videos that we have coming after this series. Anyway, that's gonna do it for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Check back all the time for new content. Take care, everyone. Thank you for watching.
Alrighty. 